Anytime we're taking on a challenge, we're gonna face some adversity. Here are a few ways you can keep going when things start to get tough. Welcome back, and congratulations on taking one more step towards becoming one of the great leaders of tomorrow. Adversity is a fact of life for any of us who want to challenge ourselves. Today I've got three tips for you to help you out when things aren't turning out the way you want. And stay tuned to the end because I'm going to give you a link to download our free leadership development plan workbook. That'll help you set your career goals for the next two, five, and ten years and build a plan of action to achieve them. There have been a lot of times in my life I've faced adversity, both personal and professional. And starting a business was a big one. I mean, I knew starting a business was going to be hard and it's not like I wasn't prepared for it, but some days it gets really tough and sometimes you feel like you want to quit. But a lot of us take on these challenges because we want to face the challenges. We want to do them because they're hard. So if this is you, if you've taken on a big challenge because it's a big challenge, because it's hard and you want to do it, but sometimes you feel like giving up, these three tips should help you dig deep and keep going when you feel like you want to quit. Tip number one for overcoming adversity is don't do it alone. We've all got a lot of people who care about us and would do anything for us. And they may not be able to do anything for us in our current situation. They may not be able to solve all of our problem or even part of our problem, but they're all usually willing to do whatever they can at least to try to make us feel better and to show us that they're confident in us. So use your support network, talk to the people around you. Sometimes just talking to someone can give you a little bit different perspective and it can give you the strength and the courage to try again a little later or just to get up tomorrow and face it as a new day. So don't do it alone. Use your support network, use the people you've got around you, and you don't have to feel like you're still alone when you're overcoming adversity. Tip number two is to find some joy in your life. And there's gonna be people watching this video who are gonna say, Jason, you're the last person who should be giving people this advice because I am the absolute worst. When I'm facing a problem, when I'm trying to overcome adversity, all I wanna do is get that problem solved and moved on to the next thing. And, I, and finding something to do that's fun or makes me feel better is the last thing on my mind. So I have people constantly reminding me, you've gotta get out and have some fun. You've gotta not take things so seriously. So. Yes, I'm a bad person to give this advice, but I'm also the perfect person to give this advice because I do this all the time. And it's really important. Taking a break, finding something you like to do, finding some joy in your life will help you, again, get some perspective, get your mind off of what it is that's troubling you, whatever that challenge is you're facing, whatever that adversity is you're trying to overcome. Find some joy in your life. Do something you enjoy and do it with people you enjoy being around. And that'll help you get your mind off it and take one more step towards overcoming whatever that challenge is. Tip number three is to just keep going. Just keep pushing. And I know it sounds too simple, but sometimes half the battle when we're facing a challenge is just showing up and trying. And yep, we're gonna fail a bunch of times. We're gonna try some new things. We're gonna fail at that too. But it's important that we just keep going. If it's important to us, we have to just keep trying. We have to just keep trying to make it work. Now there comes a time when you say to yourself, I've done everything I can do. I've exhausted all of my options and it's time to let this one go. But that really needs to be our last resort. We don't want to give up on things too quickly. Their history is littered, especially the business world is littered with stories of people who, if they had just kept going for another week or another month or another year, could have turned what they were working on into something hugely successful. So if you haven't exhausted all of your opportunities, if you aren't in a position where it's do or die and it's gotta be your family or this thing, the challenge, the, the, this challenge that you're facing, don't give up, just keep pushing. Tomorrow's a new day. Wake up tomorrow, attack it from a new perspective, try something new, just keep going. So there are your three tips for overcoming adversity when you're facing challenges and you feel like throwing in the towel. Remember, when you feel like you can't go on any further, remember that there are people who care about you and wanna see you succeed and want to help you. Remember that there are enjoyable things in life, things that you enjoy doing, and A, can take your mind off of your challenges, and B, can just make you feel better. And remember, you've got the strength to keep going. You've got the strength to go one more day. You've got the strength inside to just keep going. Try these tips the next time you're feeling overwhelmed, and I think you'll find that you really do have that strength to keep going and keep pushing and take on those challenges that you've accepted because they're hard and you want to achieve them. If you found this helpful, please like, comment, and share it with a friend or coworker. If you have any business or leadership questions, leave us a comment or email us at info at evilgeniusleadership.com. Evilgeniusleadership.com is also where you can find out about our training programs. So if you wanna do a little more one-on-one -on -one training or coaching, check us out there. Make an appointment for a free consultation. You can do that right from the website. 
and we'll get you set up and we'll find out how we can help you achieve what you're looking to do as a leader, a business person, or just in life in general. Thanks for watching today. I really appreciate it. Remember, the future is out there. Lead the way.